Hey there, Capricorn, and welcome back to Star Lord is Tarot. This is your tarot forecast for the week of December the 3rd through to the 9th. I went ahead, shuffled the cards, laid them all out. Let's see what's going on for Cappy. First up, we have the Three of Swords in the reverse position, followed then by the Two of Pentacles upright. And next, we have Major Arcana of the World in the upright, followed then by the Page of Cups upright. And lastly, we have the Nine of Pentacles in the upright. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and interpret this read for you guys. First of all, Cappy, for your overall energy, you have that of the Three of Swords in the reverse position. I do prefer to see this energy inverted as opposed to upright. When it's upright, this can represent a fresh wound. <laughs> I call it a wound because sometimes it's like when we've had our feelings hurt by somebody or by a situation. Um, it can be from a relationship, that kind of thing. It represents like, it can represent uh, sorrow, loss. Sometimes this will come up, loss of a pet or something like that, where we're really, really feeling you know, sad and, and that loss intensely. When it's inverted though, we're healing from that. So I know a lot of you Capricorns are really struggling. It's been a rough couple of years for Cappies. Um, it's about to change. I mean, this is going to be a lot easier a year for you with Jupiter in your 12th house. It's going to be a calmer year and it's going to be designed for healing for you guys. So hang in there, and a year from now, Jupiter will be moving into your sign, giving you a whole fresh new beginning, a fresh new start. So um, I'm, I'm glad to see this for you guys, because it's perfect for the 12th house energy. Healing definitely makes a lot of sense uh, for Cappies, and it's starting right away, starting this week. Beautiful energy for your overall. Coming right into the week, we have the energies of the Two of Pentacles in the upright position. Two of Pentacles, I do like this energy. It's very balanced. Um, and it's, it, this represents harmony in the midst of change. So a lot of you, if you're undergoing major changes in your life or even minor changes in your life, I know changes can be difficult for Capricorns, but um, I see you actually coming right off the hop in this week, um, having harmony with that change. This is about being able to balance and deal with two different situations. If you're dealing, say, for example, with, if you have two different jobs or two different projects on the go, you're having no problem um, maintaining everything. You're, you've got everything under control. Sometimes this can represent balancing your checkbook and you know keeping everything on the financial front uh, copacetic. For others of you, it could be representing uh, balancing two different relationships. Maybe you're dating two different people. But if that's the case, everything, again, is working fine, working like clockwork. There's nothing to be too concerned about. So beautiful energy coming into the week. And it's paired up with Major Arcana, the world in the upright position. This is really nice energy. The world is all about closing out an area or an aspect of our lives that has been probably ongoing for a long time. But it's come to its natural end, and that's very cool. Um, it's in the upright position, so it indicates you're not um, you're not resisting it at all. And definitely, I see that with the two pentacles here. So some of you, say for example, are closing out a career. Some of you could be retiring. Um, maybe you're leaving one career to start another, or maybe you're leaving one home to move into another that you've lived at for a long time, or one relationship to another. Whatever is going on, the transition seems to be going pretty smoothly for you, Capricorn. So beautiful, beautiful energy. Moving on towards the weekend, talk about nice energy. We have the Page of Cups in the upright position. Everybody knows I really like the Page of Cups. It's such sweet energy. Uh, the Page of Cups loves like it's he's never been hurt. It's that sort of sweet, uh, beautiful energy on the emotional front. But remember, it's still at the page level. So if this is your energy, first of all, this is a court card, so it could be representing a person. If it's representing a person, this can be water energy, that of Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Sun, Moon, or Rising, male or female. But the Page of Cups is very sweet um, energy, and, and pages do represent messages. So it could be Capricorn, some of you are getting a very sweet, heartfelt message from a person. Uh, doesn't necessarily have to be a water sign, could be any sign. Sometimes uh, this can represent a child too. Um, the Page of Cups could be representing a child or a grandchild that maybe is very, very dear to your heart and this person is, uh, this child is coming to you and maybe giving you a, a sweet little gift that is just making you feel really, really good on the emotional front. 
for others of you, this could definitely be a new crush. Maybe somebody's got a crush on Capricorn and is sending sweet love messages to them. <laughs> Uh, no matter how you slice it, it's a beautiful, beautiful energy. Glad to see it for you guys. And the last card you have up is the Nine of Pentacles in the upright position. This is really good for finances and security for uh, some of you. Could be representing job security. For others of you, could be representing financial security. Maybe you're feeling really good on the financial front. It's not to the extent of the Ten of Pentacles. That's sort of like the pinnacle, the peak. But the Nine of Pentacles is all about that strong, independent person. This person knows how to look after themselves. They can be um, very strong. Sometimes this will come up when a person maybe gets a small pay raise or something like that, and now they feel even more secure and more stable. For others of you, it could be representing maybe getting a job. Maybe some of you have been out of work for a while, and now you're landing a job, and you're going to be able to look after yourself very well. Uh, beautiful energy, really good reading here. I like this healing for you guys and, and the Two of Pentacles, all of it. Very good reading, Capricorn. I hope this helped you. If it did, please feel free to like, share, and subscribe. Otherwise, I'll see you next week. Bye-bye for now.